Hello, Lucy. Faye, did you see the picture of that storm on TV? No. It was big, and it moved fast, and it knocked the house down. There wasn't much left. It was all on the ground, and a teddy bear was just laying in the yard, and the walls were torn down. It was called some kind of a tomato. That's tornado, Lucy. It's a small storm with really, really strong winds, and it moves very, very quickly. Faye, it will be impossible to fix that house. There's almost nothing left. What if it happens here? My house isn't big, but I like it. No matter what happens, Lucy, we can trust God in a storm or even when there might be a storm. This was just impossible. Everything was gone. Jesus specializes in impossibles. He cares about us. He cares about our lives. He even cares about our houses. But how can he fix it? When a house is destroyed, we can trust Jesus to help us find another one. When we're afraid, we should come to him. He'll comfort us and help us. And sometimes he uses other people to help us. How do we know if he wants to use us? Often we can hear him telling us to help someone. Or maybe we don't need to be told because we're right there and see a need. We know what we ought to do. Well, I see a need, and I want to help. I want to do the impossible. I want people to know that Jesus cares. Good. I will start by praying for whoever owns that teddy bear. I know they need prayer. Then maybe Mom will let me have a bake sale. We can send the money to help the people who lost that house. I'll bake something. Great! A bake sale is just a little thing, but if lots of people help, Jesus can do the impossible. That's a great way to show that Jesus cares. I have to go talk to Mom. Be sure and tell her that I will help. Thanks, Faye. Bye. Bye.